everybody and welcome back to my channel. Now in today's video I am back with another unboxing. This one I am so excited for. Um, so let me just cover my address. So if I have covered that properly. This is coming from Toysiverse. Um, if I'm saying that right. <laughs> now this is a hit on this mystery box and I have got two inside here. The reason why I'm so excited and I'm so nervous, I'm actually shaking, um, is because one of the hits was Carl and Ellie. Uh, the two pack, obviously from Up, which would be the most incredible hit to have. Um, I don't think it's in here though, because I don't know if the box is big enough and there's two in here. So I doubt I'm going to have that. But there was a lot of other hits as well, um, such as, I think it was Joey from Friends from Wave 1. <clears throat> so that would be really cool. The Countess uh, from American Horror Story, which would be an awesome one to have. So yeah, let's just get this open and see what's in. I'm so nervous. Um, they cost me £15 each plus postage. So yeah, we shall see. Hit or miss, guys. But let's go for it. I mean, I ordered two. So they should be in separate boxes inside here. So they might not be. Let me just get into it. If I can actually get the box open, that'd be a good start, wouldn't it? Right, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna put them there. I'm just gonna go in and grab one. Okay, so they're in two separate boxes, which is awesome. So I do not have Carl or Ellie, which is heartbreaking, guys. Um, let me see, get into this if I can. Right, so good job at the double, the separate box. That's, uh, that's good because then it is a pure mystery. Right, it's not in a protector, which makes me think that it's not a hit. Okay, I'm going to close my eyes. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. Okay, so I didn't get Cal and Ali, but this makes up for it because I need the counters. So I got the counters, which I am most about. I'm so happy. Um, I was going to buy this, but people sell it for about £30, £35, so... This is a hit, which I am really, really happy with. So bored. Ah! Yeah, but like, please ignore the dog barking. Um, but like I said, it's not Carl and Ellie, which is heartbreak. But still, I got one that I've been dying for for a long time. And it's going to sit lovely next to my Holden. So <sighs> very, very happy about that. I'm buzzed, buzzed, buzzed. Uh, damage wise we've kind of got like a little rip in the corner here but and like a little few scuffs down here but to be honest with you that's just like normal pop condition now that I find like even mint pops tend to have that but yes I am so happy about that <sighs> which means this is going to be probably a miss it's very rare that I'm going to get two yeah very rare that I'm going to get two hits but I, am so, I wish I'd have opened the Countess last because that was when I really wanted <laughs> So I did say to myself, if I didn't get that, I really wanted the Countess because I love American Horror Story and that'll fit a lovely in my collection. Okay, if I can feel sweets. Okay. I can't get it out. There we go. Not sweets. Hmm. So I don't know. Okay. That's the front, I think. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, gossip girl. XOXO. Um it was a miss, because obviously I've got these here. Um, but yes, they must have fallen out in the box but that's cool um not my type of thing i don't i've never watched gossip girl actually i'm lying to you i probably watched it once when i was younger um but it's nothing i've ever remembered or wanted to watch sorry to all you gossip girl fans out there but there we go so this is dan humphrey 
from Gossip Girl. But yes. Not bad at all. Not bad. To be honest with you guys, I'm going to be completely honest. I'm surprised at the packaging and I'm happy with the packaging because it was wrapped well enough and it was everything was double boxed. So I'm happy with that. Um, so that was good. Obviously, the condition wise is perfect for my box. So I'm not going to complain at all because there's no damage to the pop itself. So that is brilliant. Um, obviously, this one was a miss, but you expect that when you do a hit or miss mystery box you're not guaranteed a hit so you know that is cool i'm not going to complain about that but like i said the condition's perfect so that's all that matters to me and it's probably like only a tenner so to be honest i've really not missed out on much to be fair um and haribos because who doesn't love haribos I love them. but there we go this i'm over the moon about i am unbelievably happy with this um it is no kyle and ellie but it is one that I need for my collection. And literally, I was going to buy it the other day as well, but I've just never, you know, there's, um, my collections, the main ones are Walking Dead, like Stitch, Disney, that type of thing. So I've never wanted to really fork out for these when I've been concentrating so much on them, because obviously this is ridiculously expensive that it breaks my heart. Um, and I was good. I missed out on the Countess the other day. So this is really cool. I am really, really happy with this. Yes, I am so happy. So very very yeah i'm buzzed so i'm close now to finishing this set which is so exciting um i'm looking over there because i've also now got a new set so you'll see in one of my videos i'm onto freak show as well so this is going to be an expensive collection now guys so thank you toys of us for making me now I want to collect them and not sell that up so no I'm so so happy so thank you guys for watching so yeah overall this is my first time buying from them and I'm pleased to be fair you know if it's a miss the thing is you see people complaining you can't because it's labeled as a hit or miss mystery box so you know that's what you get you spend your 15 pound plus your four postage I think it was or five postage I'm not too sure um and you end up with a 10 pound pop then you can't complain because you know that in the first place. So people with mystery boxes, you need to understand that, you know, if it says hit or miss, you're not guaranteed your value. So don't go in expecting to get your value out, guys. Um, Because, yeah, that's when things go downhill very quickly. But like I said, I'm happy with my miss, to be fair, because I know that Gossip Girl is quite a popular thing. Um, I'm helping anyway. <laughs> and I got sweets. But the, uh, the hit for me, sorry, is just incredible and one hit that I'm really happy about. So I am so happy. I'm going to go cradle this now because now I'm nearly there for the set collection. But yes, so thank you so much guys for watching. So what I will do is I'll attach um, the Facebook link down below so you can go and check those guys out. So do keep an eye out. Um, obviously, I've seen a lot of people with misses and it's it's... An unfortunate thing when you have a miss. Um, I know it's heartbreaking. It is so sad. But I'm very happy today, guys. And Toys of Us, I personally find I, I've had no issues with. Um, they are very talkative. And any issues I had, I contacted them straight away. So I ordered one box and then I wanted to order another. Um, and they gave me postage combined. So, you know, hands up to you guys for doing that. Because other companies could have just told me to, you know bug off so yeah i'm glad about that so thank you so much guys for watching as always a lovely like a lovely comment and a lovely subscribe would be absolutely amazing please let me know down below guys in those comments what do you think to the pops that i pulled today what do you think to my hit and what do you think to my miss i'm good that i didn't pull the miss out first but here we are so thank you so much guys i will see you all very soon and stay safe bye everybody